So you want to be able to plot multiple lines on the same graph. I'm going to look at various scenarios where you might want to do this. First of all, we'll try and do this where all the data is in the same table, but then we'll also look at a scenario where maybe the data is in different tables. You want to combine all of this data into one chart. So let's start off with this scenario. And the first thing to notice here is that I've got years as my row labels. These would be the horizontal category axis labels in my chart. And I want you to notice that these are stored as numbers. You can tell they're stored as numbers because they are on the right of the cell. Now this is going to cause a problem. If I click in my data, go to insert, over to charts, and then go to this line or area chart button. I'll go for the first line chart. The chart doesn't plot properly. And the reason it's not plotting properly is because it thinks these labels are a series within the chart. It's trying to plot these values in the chart itself. You can see the values there. Also, my category axis labels have not come through again because it's using them as a series. I just get numbers one through to 12. Now, there's an easy fix for this. If I delete this chart, what I need to do is store these labels, these row labels, as text values. Now, to do that, go into the first year and put an apostrophe in front of that year. That will store the value on the left of the cell, which means it's a text value. Then, the cell selected, drag this little fill handle down, and that will store then all of the years as text values. If you don't like these little green triangles, select the data again, go up to the little warning button, and ignore error. So now, if I click in the data, I get to insert line chart. You can see I get the years along the bottom of the chart, and it's plotted the series properly on the chart. Now, I've reset this data, and I want to take the scenario where, for whatever reason, you're not able to change these values to text values, or for whatever reason you don't want to. Now, you can still get around this problem. You want to start in a different location. Rather than clicking in the data, just click somewhere outside it. Insert line graph. Then right click in your blank chart, select data. Chart data range, what you want to do is select all of the columns, including the column headings, except for your row headings. And then under horizontal category axis labels, click on edit and select the row labels. Click on OK and you've got your chart. Okay, let's move on to the next scenario. So the next scenario is that you've been given the data in separate tables. How do you include all of this data in a single chart? Well, click into an empty cell to start with, insert line graph. Now you want to make sure this chart is not overlaying any of the data, so I'll put it over here. Now in your empty chart, right click, select data, and move this dialog box out of the way of your data and in the chart data range box select your first data set so that won't include the row labels but do include the column heading so i select that column then i hold down control and i select the next column keeping control held down i select each of these columns then under horizontal category axis labels click on the edit button and you want to include the years in one of the tables. Don't include the column heading. Click on OK. Click on OK. And you have all the data within your chart. Now, if you want something like a chart title, just click on this plus button here. You can choose your chart title there and also a legend if you need it. OK, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next video.